Shall we begin? Let's begin now. Right, what can I say? But the Bailey, Bailey Bridge. Now, I've been looking at this since, well, since I started uh, putting models together a year and a half ago. And I kept on seeing it, and I kept on thinking I'd love to do this. But what could I do it with, how I could do it, and everything else. And a few days ago, I was on the internet, and I saw it. And the master plan came in. I have a very devious plan for this, uh, which will be revealed a bit later on. But let's get on with this. This is the uh, Bailey type double double, a double height there, uh, M1 plane bridge and also this one includes the uh, pedestrian crossing or pedestrian uh, for foot traffic we'll call it on both sides of it. Uh, it's 135th scale made by Bronco. I'm really chuffed that I've got it. Uh, I've done this a couple of times because I've made a load of mistakes so everything inside has been opened and but we'll go through it as, as I normally do right it's not a great deal on the box and to be honest with you there's a lot in the box as you'll see but there's only a few sprues because they're all doubled up right we've got the workshop manual which is very thin because there's not a lot to it. We have a card with some uh, photo edge on, which we'll go through. We have packets and packets and packets of sprues. We'll, we'll put all them to one side. I'll do the uh, manual, then I'll drop the camera down and we'll have a closer look at some of the sprues. Right, nice, uh, Little booklet from Bronco, and I, is that light shining on it? I think it is. I've got quite a lot of bright light coming through. We we'll close a blind or two, and we might get somewhere. Just bear with me a second, people. Right, is that any better? Well, a little bit better, but not much. Uh, just spoo map, first page. And we're straight into the second, and this is just like a giant Meccano kit. If you've ever had Meccano, this is it. Individual units which were just bolted together to make a bridge, and it was absolutely, this was absolutely brilliant. It was. Uh, not a great deal on, you've got a lot of these to actually make. These, uh, I don't know what you'd call them, but these, these units that actually make the bridge up. Uh, Onto the second page, there's very little, just your stringers and all these sections. You actually virtually build this bridge like they put it up, and that is all the instructions that you've got. I mean, this was a, a bit of British engineering, but I don't think when I build it, I'll go the double for the simple reason is they only use the double when they uh, went across quite big spans and as it's only going to be short I think it will be quite stupid looking it won't look right so I think I'm when I build this it's only going to be with the double but single height and onto the colour which is going to be uh, that beautiful olive drab which I suppose you know, paint it pink or something make it make it a bit jazzy no no it totally spoiled it right that is the box and the workshop manual I shall stop the camera drop it down and we'll have a look at the sprues right here we go back with the sprues right this is one of one two so there's two more of those which I'm going to put to one side so I don't get lost. Uh, well, what we're looking at, it, uh, bits of Meccano. This is what we're looking at, bits of Meccano. Uh, 
I would say these uh, four. I haven't got a clue. <laughs> what am I even trying to work out what they're for? These are all going to be parts of, I would say, the actual sections. These are all going to go together uh, to make one of them little uh, square frames up. Somehow, it will all come to light when I'm doing the putting them together. Now, there's four of them, or three of them, sorry. And the next one we've got is a big pile of them. And there is a big pile of these. So, I'll put the rest of them to one side. They're all the same. Put that down there. And we've got two, four, we've got five, we've got six all together of them. Uh, what are these? Right, by the look of it, these are will be the side walkways. Just more of the actual units to go together. You've got some nice little rope ties and things like that. Uh, I would say they're the bottom of the jacks and things like that. Like I say, there's not many sprues, but there's a lot of sprues, but not many different ones because they're basically all the same. And that's that one. Uh, we've got a packet of these. These are the light like, stringers. These go across from side to side. And you've got 11 of those. Uh, and we've got one little screw on its own. When the camera is going to play, is it going to play? There we go, we're back in focus again. Uh, just say they're the end bits, the ramp and things like that. Like I say, there's not many different uh, sprues. And then we've got a whole load of these. These are the actual, uh, like the deck boards. And there is three, Six, this is eight of them all together. Uh, it's got a wood finish on, which this is taken off, must have been taken off a very early one because they found that the tanks and that going over it actually chewed the wood up. So that I remember rightly, they were cut, then covered in steel to, to, to stop that because they were constantly on alert to, to, repair, to repair the bridge. But like I say, there's nothing there of great interest but it's it's all when it all comes together that's the bit I like we have got a bag of brass pins this is for the uh, for the foots I forgot what I was going to call it then the uh, pedestrian crossing should I say these are the for the ropes to stop the uh, soldiers from falling over and then we have a little bag of the tiniest little I think they're nut heads and that's going to be interesting to find out where they go and then we've got a piece of rope for the uh, foot traffic part we've got a very small piece of uh, photo edge there what it's for I haven't got a clue but there's loads of little tiny bits and finally, a very large piece of photo edge. Oh, I know what these bits are for. These go on the end of the double mounts to hold them all together. What these other bits for, I haven't got a clue. So, but that's all, it, all that's in the box. A lot of it, but not very much. And that will be built not too soon, but soon. I've still got quite a bit to clear up on my bench. I've got to get the, the Bedford gun tractor done. I've got to get the Chevrolet done. Uh, that's all got to be done first. And then that will be coming up. Well, thank you very much for joining me. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. If you like what I'm doing, give me the thumbs up. And I'll see you on the, on the next one.